flight JT610 fell into the sea shortly after takeoff in October, and sadly all 189 souls aboard died on impact. Shortly after leaving the airport on its journey to Pankal, Penang, the pilot asked air traffic control for permission to turn back to the airport, but shortly afterwards contact with the plane was lost. Investigators say that the plane had started to encounter technical problems. The Boeing 737 hit the water at high speed, meaning that the plane broke into thousands of pieces, making it difficult to pinpoint the crash site, but also meant that the black box could be anywhere in the ocean. After four long months of scanning the ocean bed, scuba divers have now found the black box to the plane. Now, like I said earlier, the plane hit the water's surface at high speed. Uh, in fact, they hit it at such a high speed that the black box, which is pretty indestructible, was split in two. Uh, it was found at 50 meters down, uh, near where the plane's data recorder was found back in November. Now, the black box has been handed over to investigators who can still recover the data from the box. It will just take a little bit longer than normal. Hopefully, the black box will be one of the five final pieces of the puzzle to find out exactly what happened. Investigators have a pretty good idea as to what went wrong, and sadly it's a pretty simple one though. The plane just wasn't airworthy yet, uh, and more technical tests needed to be carried out before it's set flight. In fact, the plane was known to have faults due to it having problems on earlier flights, but it was still put back into service. So this really all could be just easily avoided. Our thoughts of course go out to everybody who's been affected by the crash.